Florida State takes on Wake Forest in just a couple of days. And if you remember back to last year, there was some maybe slight animosity around this game. Um, Dave Clawson said some things about Florida State playing in the path of a hurricane. And Florida State folks, including us, fired back at what was meant there. But Dave Clawson said something this week that truly shocked me. And I'm going to play you the clip here in just a minute, and then we're going to talk about it. Make sure you stay around to the end because I've got a hilarious Keon Coleman clip that you need to see as well. But we're going to talk about what Dave Clawson said that certainly surprised me and something that I did not expect at all. Take a look. And, and I would say this. I don't know if anybody uh, in the ACC has done a better job of embracing and maximizing what college football looks like in 2023. Um, and, and I mean that as a, a nothing but a compliment to Mike, because there's places that probably have healthy collectives and money, but it's misspent. You know, they've done a great job of retaining their best players, you know, to get Jordan Travis to come back, to get Jared Verse to come back, to get Trey Benson to come back, to get Johnny Wilson to come back. Like their best players are all back. And they lost some guys in the portal as well but their ability to replace them, you know, with a guy like a Keon Coleman uh, or a Fentel uh, Cypress, you know, they've done a very, very good job of evaluating and picking players that fit them. And uh, he really has. He's, he's done an amazing job. Uh, okay. So did you hear that? Did you hear who he was bragging on? He was giving Mike a lot of praise. He was talking a lot about what Florida State has done he went on to talk about Mike as a play caller. But the thing that stood out is that without calling them by name, he started to brag on the battle's end. He started to brag on Florida State's NIL collective that works mostly with football. And not only did he brag on how much money they have or how many supporters they have or anything like that, he bragged about how they're more effective than just about anyone else in the country and they spend their money better than just about anybody else in the country now thousands of you are going to watch this video if the video does really well it may get up around ten thousand. if the video just does okay maybe do around two or three four thousand but thousands of you are going to watch this video and i would ask that you share it if you appreciate the content that's in it but Here's what I need you guys to realize is that if Dave Clawson was not the head coach of Wake Forest, I'm pretty certain that he would be signed up and be a Battles End member. He basically just did a one minute commercial in his press conference for the Battles End. Yet, we put 80,000 people in the stadium every Saturday. We've sold out every game so far. And only have, what, a 1,000 Battles End members? It was just posted this week that Florida State hit 1,000 TBE members. Again, more people will watch this video than are signed up for the Battles End. Ingram Smith, their CEO, put out a um, post today on where they need to get to. This morning, he said, as of this morning, the number now sits at 1,000 102 members. We had a projected 2K by the end of the season and need all the support we can to reach this benchmark. And what I'm telling you guys today is this. We can do it with just this video. Now, I know you hate ads. I know you hate people trying to sell you stuff. I know you hate people asking you to subscribe. I know that you don't like all that, and I get it. But what I'm telling you is let's be the channel. Let's be the group. Let's be the folks that do this. I don't get a kickback. If you put my name in as the referral or double fries, no slaw in as the referral, we don't get anything from that. But let's be the channel that bumps them up over that 2,000 members. Again, thousands of you will watch. Can we get 900 of you to go sign up? They have all kinds of different levels. You can sign up for as little as 1993. You'll get that reference, of course, if you're an FSU fan, a month, all the way up to as much money as you want to donate. I personally give at the $100 a month level. I believe that what they provide and what they're doing for our student athletes and for our football team that I so dearly love is well worth that. If I could give more financially, I absolutely would. And I plan on increasing the amount that I give 
every single month. All of the revenue from this video will be going to the battle's end as well. I don't ask you guys to do anything that I'm not doing. They also do some really, really cool content. And it helps our student athletes, not only with their NIL deals, but it helps you in return because you get cool content like this. I told you about a cool Keon Coleman video, and I want you guys to check that out by watching right here. It's either that or we get a Waffle House. And what's your Waffle House order? <laughs> Sausage, egg, and cheese, gripple, full, full egg, scrambled cheese, a side of pork chops, hash brown with cheese, and a high C. Okay. So you just, you get your hash browns with cheese, nothing else. Oh yeah, what else you gonna put on? Ham, onions, you scatter, onions. You scatter well. How do I smother, man? Yeah, smother, cover, dice, chop. I don't even know what you talking about. Yeah. Ain't There's nothing. a whole, whole language. We putting cheese on that, <laughs> mixing that up and eating it. That what we doing. You know people don't know Waffle House got pork chop. No, I'm, uh, yeah. People they didn't know that though. They didn't know that sometimes. Cause they're looking at the menu, you just gotta, you just gotta know. So you get your hash browns scattered well, you know what that is? Just cook them. I like mine a little light brown. I don't like mine all, all okay. burnt. That's burnt. I ain't trying to tell you how to order it. Yeah. It's either that. Hilarious. Keon's absolutely hilarious. And that's the kind of content that you get, not just the funny stuff, but we'll show another video here in just a moment. But that's the kind of content that you get because you're donating to the battle's end and because they're working with our student athletes. Now, how do you sign up? You can go to thebattlesend.com. You can join today. If you want to blow this thing up, if you want Florida State to be the athletic program that we all know that it should be, if you want this football team to continue to have the success and be able to work with guys like Jordan Travis, Keon Coleman, Jared Verse, Trey Benson, and others that are on this roster, you need to be signed up. Go to thebattlesend.com, sign up for any level. If you comment below that you signed up, I will take your name and enter it into a drawing. I'll confirm with them that you did sign up, and I'll get you one of those Battles End quarter zips. We'll pick one person who signs up through this video or who writes our name, Double Fries No Slaw, as the referral. I'll pick one person that signs up after today or today and on and make sure that I get them one of these battles in quarter zips that you see from our guys, Kalen and Tatum, on the screen here in just a moment. They've also done really cool videos, taking an inside look at the Kalen Deloach scoop and score, the Braden Fisk run, the Tatum Bethune run down with him. Really, really good stuff, really neat content that's able to be put out thanks to the support and membership of so many people. Listen, 1,100 members. Let's be the channel. Let's be the group that puts them up over 2,000. Put double fries, no slaw in there again. We don't get anything from it. I just want them to know that it was our people that put them over the top. Share this video if you're already a member. And if you sign up today, comment below, and I will get you one of those Battles End quarter zips that I love so much. I'll pick one winner to make sure that we are supporting there as well. I want to show you a quick clip from this Tatum Bethune, Kalen Deloach interview. We're showing it as we talk right now on the side. I'll show you a quick clip from it, and then we will let you guys go. Thank you for all your support. If you are signed up, if you're one of the 1,100 that are signed up for the Battles in, thank you for that. People are taking notice. Dave Clawson of Wake Forest is taking notice, and he sounds like he's about to sign up for the Battles End. Make sure that you're part of what helps Florida State take it to the next level in the future. Appreciate you guys. Love you guys. Go Nose. Before that game, we, uh, our, we, were, we were sitting down with our families and we were just talking about how one of us just wanted to have a, a turnover for a touchdown. Play action, Klubnik, blitz coming. Klubnik drilled, the ball is loose. It's a fumble, it's picked up by the Knolls. Deloach the other way. He's got a convoy, trot in there, baby! Touchdown, FSU! It really started off with him though, his communication. We uh, we called a blitz, but at first he, we, uh, we switched it. And then once he switched it, I heard the safety. He just said my number and I just took off running. And then, you know, he was also blitzing too. So for him to take up the guard and the running back, 
it just opened the hole wide open. So when I seen that, I just dug in deeper. And 